for Tony Giantana, it's hard to choose a favorite project. That's like picking a favorite kid. But if he had to, it would be the 505. 505 is, it's hard for me not to have a special place in my heart about 505. His one regret, it wasn't tall enough. 505 was originally approved for 60 stories. But when I went out to get capital, the capital was um, of the opinion that Nashville wasn't mature enough, wasn't ready for a 60 story building. So they took 15 stories off. I think that taller is better, and uh, hopefully, um, it'll probably happen after I retire, but I, hopefully the city will embrace tall buildings because I think that is our future. That's his motto, at least when it comes to his work, which is where his new favorite comes into play, 1010 Church Street. It'll be bigger, and in his eyes, better than the 505. 505 was incredibly successful, 178 condos, on top of 350 apartments, on top of 500 parking spaces. So keep that in mind just a second. 1010 is 140 condos on top of 360 apartments on top of 500 parking spaces. This project is his redemption for what the 505 could have been. His, I told you so. 1010 is in every way kind of an improvement on 505. It'll be the tallest building in the state at 750 feet tall. It's been a long time in the works since 2020. It's setting records in many ways, including the financing. If you asked 100 professionals around the world, could we do this in Nashville, Tennessee right now? 100 would say no, but we decided to go ahead and do it anyway. And in early April, they closed on $232.3 million in construction financing, making it the fourth largest such loan in the country this year. Big for us, but it's really big for the city of Nashville as well. It, it underscores what the world thinks of us. Mm -hmm. um, they, it's not just us believing in ourselves. The world now sees that Nashville has a lot going on a lot going for it. Tony says this is the building that will define Nashville's skyline, even more so than the Batman building. But don't expect any spires at the top of this one. I, I like nice, clean uh, architecture. I don't like appendages and things like that. I just let the, let the building's architecture be elegant, graceful. The facade is like pleated across. It has a crown at the top, kind of an ornamentation at the top a tiara, if you will, but this building is going to sparkle. 1010 will open up in 2027. Over the years, I have uh, began to think that a building of 750 feet was my Moby Dick and that someday I'm going to be wrapped up in harpoon cables and rolling around in the ocean um, uh, at my demise. But um, we're finally getting to do it, and I think the uh, city and the state will be very proud of this building. Nikki Burdine, News 2.